Welcome to livingpianos.com. An interesting question for you is which are better, wood pianos or black ebony pianos? Now you go to the symphony, on stage is that classic black piano. You think of a piano as being black, but sometimes you see exotic woods, rosewood, you see carved pianos, and you know they cost substantially more sometimes. You wonder, is there a benefit to wood pianos versus black pianos? And that's an interesting question with many ramifications. First of all, right out of the gate, I'm gonna tell you, structurally and sonically, there is absolutely no difference between the sound or the way a piano that has a wood finish or a black piano plays or sounds. So then what the heck difference does it make? Well, first of all, there are many elements of the woods used in pianos that do make a tremendous difference, but pianos have had veneers on them, you know, for well over a hundred years. So whatever the veneer is on top, whether it has a just a natural wood finish or a sprayed lacquer, whether it's high gloss or satin, makes no difference in the sound of the piano. However, interestingly, the wood underneath that finish, even on the rim of the piano, makes a big difference or can impart a difference in the tone of the piano. Typically, many Asian production pianos utilize the soft Luan mahogany indigenous to the region and they're also easier to bend than the hardwoods used in American and German pianos, which is a much more arduous task to work with that kind of hardwoods. So why do they do it? Well, the benefit is since the soundboard is embedded into the rim, having a hardwood in the rim could actually become part of the resonating chamber. So indeed, the wood that a piano is made from does make a difference. The actual finish no, but the wood makes a difference. Now, of much greater significance is the wood of the soundboard. Now, almost all pianos today have spruce soundboards, but there's many different quality levels of spruce, and some soundboards are, are uh, laminated woods with a cross grain, which kind of defeats the purpose of the fine spruce because you generally, the cement between those layers is going to inhibit the sound, even though, a laminated soundboard is far stronger, will last longer, and is impervious to cracks, just like plywood is stronger than just regular hardwood. So there are many things to consider in the different woods of a piano. For example, if you had the opportunity to have uh, a wood piano or a black piano, and you really didn't care one way or the other, um, black pianos tend to be more popular so if you ever were to sell that piano, it's, you might have a lot easier time selling a black piano than a wood piano. Now, it's not that wood pianos, uh, there aren't people who look for them. There are people who definitely love wood pianos and are willing to pay a premium because, as I said, new pianos, the wood finishes tend to cost a little more because they have to have matching veneers instead of just spraying over with black uh, paint, essentially, or lacquer or polyester, depending upon whether it's high gloss or satin finish. However, the fact of the matter is if you have a really beautiful wood piano, even though it might be harder to connect with someone who's looking for that particular shade of wood, that person may be willing to pay a premium to get it. So there's a lot to weigh here in the type of finish of a piano. And ultimately you should get what you like because chances are you're not buying a piano to sell it. You're buying a piano to enjoy it. So get what you like and any piano that you need to sell, you wanna have a timeline so that you're not under the gun because it's not always easy to connect with someone looking for whatever piano you happen to have. And like anything that's relatively expensive, you want to have time to list it and of course put it into top shape and all of that. But in terms of the sound and the playing, there is absolutely no difference in the finish of your piano. So once again, I'm Robert Estrin here at livingpianos.com, your online piano resource. Thank you subscribers, I appreciate it. And ring the bell, brings these videos to more people when they're searching on YouTube for videos, they'll see this more often. So if you want that to happen, go for it. Ring the bell, subscribe, and once again, I'll see you next time. Thanks for joining me.